What's going on, boys and girls? Hello once again. Tis day numero whatever comes after Ocho. Number nine. Day number nine. Chloe, how was your day? Good. I'm exhausted. I woke up a little late again. Sorry. But I just did. Didn't hear my alarm the first time. I don't know why. I, don't, I think I'm going to start setting two alarms. I think that might be the solution. What do you think, Chloe? Tell me. Oh, okay. Understood. Uh, today was a tiring day. I worked 7 to 4. Came home. Picked up my car from being done with alignment. Went to choir. Came home. Now I'm here. Hi, everyone. <sighs> tired. So, what I, here's the plan for tonight. I did not do my ab exercises this morning, so I'm going to do that right after I'm done with my video. Then I'm going to sh trim my beard a little bit, because it's getting out of control. Take a shower, go to bed. Tomorrow, I plan on working on my math test that's due Tuesday. I've been putting this off and putting... Actually, I haven't been putting it off. I've been stinking busy. <laughs> um... But not, I've been doing other schoolwork, you know what I mean? Like, something as big as a take-home math test, I want to be able to sit down and work on and devote some time to it. It's gonna, I want to devote a few hours to it at least. Um, so you know how that is. What do you think, Chloe? You want to take my math test? Is that what you said? Chloe, you're great. What do you know about matrices? Yeah, well... Probably not a lot, Chloe. Probably not a lot. So, today from my Bible reading, Romans 6.6. 6. Um, let me grab my Bible. Because it's a good verse. It is a good verse. Oh, uh, 1 Thessalonians 5.18. And everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. That's a great verse, because a lot of people want to know what God's will is for their life. That's a huge topic in our Christian realm. Well, there it is. There's one of the things. You know how you always hear preachers say, if you want to know God's will for your life, do God's will for you now. Well, that's, I believe, First Thessalonians 5.18. Let me just read it to you. I, I quoted it, but I want to read it again. And everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. I believe that is the only verse in the Bible that clearly states this is God's will. I could be wrong on that. Correct me if I'm wrong. Feel free. Uh, I'm thinking there might be another one, now that I've said that. But that is, that is one of the verses that strictly says this is God's will. A lot of people searching for God's will, searching for God's will. But you need to be doing God's will for your life now. And that's one thing you can do is be thankful. And that's what we're working on this month. Um, anyway, sorry, there was a, kind of jumped off there. Romans 6, 6. Knowing this, that our old man is crucified with him, that the body of sin might be destroyed, that henceforth we should not serve sin. So, we do not have to serve sin. That's what I was thankful for. Or, that's the blessing out of my Bible today. Um, I heard... I was listening to something, I was searching for the, let's try this again, rewind, okay, yeah, I was searching for the song on YouTube, Thank God I Am Free, um, where the second verse, like a bird out of prison that's taken its flight, and I was listening to this preacher, I don't know if he was charismatic or something, but he was, he was pretty excited about that, just talking about that song, and he's like, when when a bird is, is stuck in a cage and they get released, what do they do? They go like this, right? Flap, flap, flap. No, they jump out of that cage as fast and as quickly as they can. They get out of there. They flap, 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 flap. They get out as soon as they can. So his point was, you know, there's Christians that are still sitting in the cage even though even though we're free, we fly back into the cage of sin. So that's just an interesting analogy. Um, 
I don't know if he's a charismatic or like a... I don't know, he was pretty... I don't know what he was saying was pretty good. But I don't know, like, I wouldn't, like, say, Go listen to all his sermons. He is the best doctrine ever. No, I wouldn't say that. Because I don't really know that much about him. I just thought it was cool. Um, I sent it to Adam. I don't know if... did Adam, did you watch that? I thought it was pretty cool. But maybe he said something that Adam didn't like. I don't know. Adam, did he say something he didn't like? No, um... You probably just didn't get a chance to watch it. Um, let's see. Oh, today I was thankful for good friends, basically. Um, we had a good, fun night last night playing soccer. Um, and we won 6-4. to four. Pretty exciting. So that was cool. And praise the Lord for that. And my mom, I'm going to say something on Facebook soon about this. That little, if you guys saw the little number two on my Facebook post that I said something about my mom, she did that. She went on my computer while I was at work and she wrote that up and posted it. Can you believe that? Unbelievable. I'm not lying. This really happened. And I can prove it to you. You know how I can prove it to you? Why would I put a number two up of something? I would just save it for the next day, right? I didn't do it. But it's quite funny. And of course I feel that way about her. Love you, Ma. Chloe, do you love Mom? Chloe, do you love Mom? She said no. Sorry, Mom. Um, okay, so I need to get my exercises done. And I want to go to bed. <laughs> so tired. <laughs> okay, just kidding. Tomorrow is Sunday. And um, we have church tomorrow. I'm taking my shoes off. Better plug your nose. All right. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a grand old night of sleep. And uh, this is my second long. Nope. This is my longest vlog. Stink. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. And everything is going good with you. And I don't know why I just did that. Okay, I was trying to end it funny, but, like, it just failed epically. So, Chloe, say goodbye. Say goodbye. No, say bye. Say bye. <laughs> She's like, what was that? All right, see you guys. Bye.